Hi, Clara here. Long time no see. Hope you guys are happy and lucky in the new year. Today we are going to tell solution of Rika's laser problem. You can find the issue and corresponding solution in this video. If you are first time being here, please don't forget to subscribe to this channel, give me your like and share the video. It's important to me. Thank you. Let's get started. First of all, to reiterate the premise, whether it's your machine or laser, as long as it's within the warranty period, please contact your supplier for help and solutions as soon as possible. Don't look for similar questions and answers online and try to figure it out on your own. Personally, I don't think it's a good idea. In the summer or after heavy rain or when the local humidity is relatively high, we turn on the machine in the morning or the laser is restarted after a period, such as a week, we may encounter condensation and high humidity alarms. The reason for the alarms is temperature discrepancy. When the equipment is not running, the temperature difference between the inside and outside of the laser is large, resulting in the condensation of moisture in the air inside the laser. When the laser is turned on again, the internal ambient humidity is self-tested. When the detection humidity is greater than 70%, the laser will report a humidity alarm. The humidity alarm is calculated by detecting the humidity of the air inside the laser. The dew point alarm is calculated by detecting the dew point temperature of the air inside the laser. Here, simply put, the dew point is the temperature that water vapor become the temperature of liquid water. In different environments, this dew point is different. The chart here, you can take a reference. Speaking of which, what are the solutions against the two alarms? First, equip the lasers with separate air conditioner. Second, when starting the laser, first turn the key switch of the laser to off. Turn on power of the laser and let the air conditioner run for about 15 minutes before turning on the chiller. When the temperature of the water chiller reaches the set temperature, turn on the laser by turning on the laser key switch to the REM. In addition to save time the next day, we can also turn the key switch of the laser to off on the first day and then turn off the power switch of the laser after the temperature of the chiller returns to room temperature. After this operation, the air conditioner will continue to dehumidify the inside of the laser to prevent the temperature difference between the inside and outside after the power is off, resulting in condensation or humidity alarm. In addition, the laser may generate a humidity or dew point alarm during operation. This may be due to the cooling effect of the laser being poorly reduced due to the clogging of air conditioning filters. We need to clean the filters of air conditioners. That's all our today topic. Hoping it will be helpful for you. Please leave your comments below. We can learn together. Thanks for being here. See you next week. Bye. Quick talk. Please click the link below and see what products and service we could offer.